Hi everyone, recently I bought this small gadget uh, for sharpening knives. Now, it's a tiny, tiny little gadget. It's called Any Sharp, and it says the world best knife sharpener. Now, um, I've used it for now a couple of months and it's, believe it or not, it's doing the job, it's set on the tin. It does work, it's tiny and I'll show you the thing it's supposed to do. Now here, if I get close up here we go, a bit more close up there. As you can see there's a two kind of a blade parallel to each other here. And when the blade becomes blunt, you can <clears throat> replace your blade by taking out those two screws. You can get a replacement blade to um use obviously you can have a, well, reuse the blade so you don't have to check it away once you uh, those two elements becomes blunt okay and it's really really sturdy tough has a little section at the back where you can put a, on a table surface or worktop or your kitchen tabletop and basically how it works uh, it's a very good design absolutely stunning design cheek um, nicely designed so what you do you put it on, a, on the surface of your tabletop and basically pulls this lever towards you like that and so it sticks it's like basically we putting up your sat nav or whatever on your own screen just like that. It sucks into the you can literally sticks to your surface. Right, and then the next thing you do is you grab your old knives, you go a couple of those, so I got a couple of those here. Now one or two of them really really blunt. This one is lost like I mean, incredible. Look, this is how pressure I'm putting on this knife. Now, uh, literally useless. And this gadget will save you hundreds and hundreds of pounds in the shop. You know, you can spend silly amount taking it to the knife sharpening shop or whatever you call to get your knife sharp. This gadget is ideal for home. It's not a commercial gadget, you can literally use it at home. So what you tend to do is you put your knife within the the elements here, these two elements, okay, these two here, and you just strike it towards you basically. Yeah, like that. Yeah, get a good couple of times. Good, good pull. And as you can see, it's grinding the, the knife. Give it a good couple of times. Now you can see that, yes, it has become sharper. So, what you need to do. If you think you need a bit more, keep on doing it. It will hopefully save you some. It will save you a bit of money. Like it has become short. Let's try with this one. Some of this knife you need to do a few times. You know, keep doing it till you are happy with it. If 
your serious chef for them obviously you can invest in one of these commercial ones or you can take it obviously the the restaurants and hotel they use their own shopping company look look how shop has become now but wow incredible wow wow now with the larger knives okay you need to do i guess you need to slightly a few times just go start at the bottom and slowly go towards the end of the tip of the knife start at the bottom a few times let's check it wow as you like the more sharper is better right so now just to show you let's go close up a bit and we can see the granules as you can see at the bottom of that the residues from the knife look okay right you have so Let's take it out, lift this up. Right. Look at it. As you can see, there is the residues, the little radicals from the knife. So, there we go. so literally now be careful with this small amount of metal you don't want to get into your food so you just take it to your sink and you wash it the same thing the same thing we do you do with the knife because they can contain gradually you know a small amount of uh, chipped metal so you, you have to wash it or wipe it so do the washing okay so wash, wash them nice yeah wash them nicely so you don't get any residues okay and then to test it Chopping board here. Uh, we get a tomato, a bit of tomato here, and we can literally chop this tomato. Wow! Look how easy I'm chopping this tomato. And prior to this, these knives were literally blunt. Okay, look, look how easy. Wow! Look at that nice and sharp chopped let's use the bigger one wow look at that uh, the reason it's taking a bit of time is my tomato is quite soft so that's the reason okay now we can do this Chop this cucumber a bit. I'll show you. Alright, let's take the plastic out. Right here. Okay. 
easy. Easily does it. Right. Because sometimes at home you do not need your knife to be that really sharp. You'll cut yourself, won't you? So, there you go. This will do you wonder that, you know, if you... Let's put it this way. I'm using it for a few months now and I'm pretty pleased with this. And it's doing the job I'm tempted to do. Lovely. So, if this gadget helps you, I'll put a link in the description. You can go and order one and check it out yourself. And let me know you know hopefully you'll enjoy it and will possibly never ever take your knife to a knife sharpening shop again this will be your biggest investment you probably make once again thank you so much for watching this video and all of my other videos please make sure you click like and subscribe button thank you